just get so nervous for my birthday always and I just don't know why but I just I'm not really a big fan of like my own birthday this year I wanted to do something fun so I'm throwing a little bit of like a dinner party for my friends which I think is gonna be really nice and then after that my family is gonna come so I feel like it's gonna be a really good day Yo woke me up this morning he decorated the house a little bit and he gave me a few presents which was really nice which I will show you later right now we're actually gonna head into the city for a little bit because we want to go get a coffee and then maybe like a piece of cake or a pastry or something because if you know you know but coffee dates are my favorite thing in the world so we just had to do it on my birthday This is actually one of your piss presents for me. I have been wanting to get this Jerv Avenue shirt for like the longest, longest time and I never actually ordered it. And now Yop got it for me for my birthday. If it's the right size, I think I'm also gonna wear it today. It's the white breezy shirt and I'm honestly so, it looks quite big actually, but it's a size small. So I feel like the sizing should be right, but I am so excited about this. I've been wanting to get this one for like so long. And I feel like it's such a good basic. So I'm so excited that you've got this for me. So I'm gonna redo my makeup and then try this on. And if it's nice, I'm gonna wear this today. We're a little bit behind schedule because I, invited my friends in about 40 minutes and we're actually not done yet i just arranged the flowers and we hung up like the lights and stuff and it's honestly really turning out the way that i had it in my head yop is now on his way to pick up the cake and then he's also going to stop by the supermarket to get like the last things and then we're going to set the table two years ago when we all turned 21 you did these like i don't know if this is actually a national thing but in the netherlands people do like 21 dinners we did that with my friend group and i honestly really love that and we also try to do this thing where we have this like dinner club kind of where we try every month that one of our friends hosts a dinner and i honestly really love that concept which is also why i just really wanted to do something like this for my birthday i honestly just prefer like a dinner or something over just like a regular birthday party i feel like i would prefer a dinner and i just find it so much more exciting and i'm honestly really excited now because like the flowers and stuff they just look really cute so i'm really happy with like kind of the style that we chose so i'm super excited to do something like this but i do have to say that i got a a lot of help from Yop today obviously like he is helping me with all the food and like the drinks and getting groceries and setting the table and just he's helping me a lot today so that's also just really nice I think setting up the table is gonna take up most of the time now before my friends arrive but we did look at kind of how we wanted to set the table and we got like specific things so I feel like it also shouldn't take up that much time but I also made these little menu cards which I still need to print out and I'm gonna put those on the table yeah I'm really happy with everything that we prepared. I feel like it could look very nice. I think I'm just gonna finish my makeup and then change and then I will show you how we're gonna set the table. This is the final outfit. I'm honestly so excited about the Jerv Avenue shirt. It looks a little bit big, but it's honestly kind of the oversized look that I was going for. So the shirt is Jerv Avenue. My pants are from An Other Stories and then the Adidas Samba. I'm honestly so excited. Everything is exactly how I wanted it to look. So now I'm just gonna finish setting the table and then my friends are gonna come.
pretend and say that it's still the day after, but it's not. Yesterday after we cleaned the entire house, I was so dead and I brought it on the couch for like the entire day. I was just so low on energy and I was just so tired from the entire weekend. So I just decided to let it go and just lay on the couch the whole day. But I still wanted to show you what I got for my birthday. And honestly, the whole day was just so nice. It was exactly how I planned it to be. And we ended up being really lucky with the weather because the whole past week it said that it would rain and then every time it was like it might rain but it also might not and there were these like storms in like other parts of the Netherlands and here there was no rain. It wasn't that warm, but it was still like warm enough to be outside and it didn't rain. Like the fact that it didn't rain just made me so happy because I was so scared that it was gonna rain. I was really happy with the food we chose to make and the drinks were actually really good. And honestly, everything ended up just fitting together. Like I was so scared that things wouldn't fit, but for example, the flowers were so pretty. For some reason it just clicked and it was exactly like what I wanted it to look like. So I would definitely recommend if you wanna do something like this for your birthday, please do it because it's honestly so nice. I know that like hosting some kind of dinner is a lot more effort, a lot more work. And it's also obviously more expensive because you have to buy like all of the ingredients, the decor, everything, but it's honestly so worth it. So please do it if you're thinking about it. So now I wanna show you what I got. Basically, I didn't really know what I wanted to ask for because every time I have so many things that I wanna buy and then when my birthday comes around, I just don't know anymore. Like suddenly my head just gives an error and I'm like, I don't know what I want. But one thing that I did want was this Jerf Avenue shirt. I wore it on my birthday, so I showed you what it looks like, but I have been wanting this shirt for like so long. So Yop got it for my birthday and I'm honestly so happy with it. And then Yop also gave me this very, I guess you could say thoughtful gift because if you know, you know, I love coffee dates. He made his own voucher for coffee dates for us. And he even put like pictures of us like being on a coffee date. And I thought that was so cute. And it's so like fitting for me because going on coffee dates is like my favorite type of date. And the card's also really cute. And he gave me these pencils for my journaling. So that's very useful because I didn't really have like any colored pencils. We honestly really like giving each other presents. So I have two more from Yo. Basically three, but one is a surprise and he's not telling me what it is until it happens. I'm not gonna say what I think it is, but I have a little bit of a feeling, but I will tell him like after if it was actually like what I thought. But basically he said it's a surprise and I will just know when it happens or something. I don't know, he's not telling me anything else, but he still has a surprise, which is like the gift. But I don't know when, so I guess we'll see when I will get that. I guess. But he did get me these glasses and I have been so obsessed with these glasses for like honestly I think like two months. And obviously this one is like not vintage because we bought this at a store. But these are like the newer versions of the vintage ones because I feel like my grandma used to have these in like green. This dark green color which you can find a lot at like thrift stores and stuff. But I feel like they just remade it in like new colors and this one I'm just obsessed with it. So I'm very glad that Job got this for me. And then lastly we obviously went for a coffee date on my birthday and i had this book that i wanted to see if i could find it and i did it's the new emily henry book and i have honestly never read emily henry before but i've seen a lot of positive reviews about this book i really wanted to read this and i was gonna get this as a birthday present for myself on my birthday but then yop ended up giving it to me yeah i'm excited to read this when i finish my current book then i got a new running outfit from yop his parents so they gave me these green Gymshark shorts. And then with that, I was really looking for a top that is like so much less warm than a t-shirt. So they got me this top, which is basically a top and a sports bra in one. So I'm gonna try this. And if it's nice, I'll probably also get it in black because I feel like this is gonna be so good because you also don't have to wear a sports bra, which is obviously another layer of clothing. So I feel like this is just so much less warm than like a sports bra and a t-shirt. So yeah, very excited to start running in this. Got a gift card and this game, which I'm gonna try. And I got this from Yop, his brothers. And other than that, I basically got some money because like I said, I wasn't really sure what I wanted to ask for. And I didn't really wanna just come up with things for the sake of it. Like I really wanted to get things that I actually want. So I feel like with money, it is less personal to give money, but you can just get whatever you want with it. And I just love that. 
but for example in like a month I could be like finding something and be like oh I really want to get this and then I'm like oh I have this money for my parents and then I still feel like I got that gift from my parents and with that example like my parents gave me money for a gift but then my mom also gave me this porn star martini kind of thing you have to add ice to it and then shake it and then you have like porn star martini which is one of my favorite cocktails so i thought it was very funny that my mom got this like as an extra little gift so yeah i do really like getting money for your birthday because you can just get what you want with it so i also got money for my friends because i was kind of debating on getting another Jeff avenue shirt but i was a little bit unsure about it because i obviously didn't have this one already so i think i want to try this one first and then maybe i can order it later and then it will still be like a gift from my friends but I have more time to think about what I want as a gift and lastly my brother gave me this brother sister lunch so we are going for lunch together which we honestly never really do with just the two of us so I feel like that's also really nice yeah that's everything that I got I really like my birthday this year and I honestly never really liked my birthday let's just put that out there but this year we just put a lot of effort into it and we just made it exactly how I wanted it to be and honestly that was so nice so yeah it was just a really good day and with that I want to end this video I really hope you guys liked it and give it a thumbs up if you did make sure you subscribe to my channel for more videos and I will see you in the next one.